Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Hey guys, so today we are doing a side-by-side -side comparison for the Galaxy Tab S4, and that is the Samsung keyboard case versus the Logitech 380 Bluetooth keyboard. And overall, between these two, I really wanted to find out which one is the best one for productivity, to type up papers, emails, and be overall productive as Samsung claims I can be with this tablet. So overall, I really wanted to see which one was the better one. Now, right away, when it comes to just the better feeling keyboard, I easily have to give that to Logitech One, just because when you put these side by side, the Logitech is definitely wider. It's easier to type with, and I feels more natural overall. Now, I tested this out by doing a couple of speed tests at typing, and overall, while neither was perfect, definitely when I compare these two, the Logitech keyboard had a better words per minute and better accuracy when compared to the Samsung keyboard case. Overall, this kind of showed me that not only was I more accurate and where the words per minute was better, but it just felt better overall. Not only that, but then we go to the multimedia keys. Things like home, back, and recent apps are not present on the Samsung keyboard. For some reason, the keys they decided to add were keyboard, search, and language. I can understand the search one, but that's about it. I don't understand why keyboard and language were put in there for no reason, apparently. Overall, I don't understand why you would need those, especially keyboard when you have the search button, and instead of a back button or a home button. Yes, I realize you can just touch the screen when you need to, but is it really something that's gonna be that much more often or at least allow it to be programmable? Overall, I had a better time typing with a separate keyboard, but then we go to the convenience factor. The convenience factor of the Samsung keyboard case is obviously that you have an all-in-one solution and you just travel with it. The Logitech keyboard, you obviously are traveling separate with it uh, as compared to having a regular case and then you have a keyboard separately. But when you do type, I feel you're better off overall, even though the traveling might have a little bit less hassle. Overall, with the Samsung keyboard case, I feel it does add too much weight as well. And while I do see it for minimizing my traveling when I want to go maybe just to Starbucks and I don't wanna take a full separate keyboard, it might be a better solution. Overall, I think for most people, if you want to be productive, I think you're gonna be better off getting the Logitech keyboard as opposed to the Samsung keyboard case. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section down below. Between these two, I definitely see both merits. I just wish Samsung would have made some better decisions when it came to the actual keys. And overall, I think they could have cut the weight down a little bit more as well. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Thank you as always for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, why don't you go ahead and subscribe up there. Make sure you follow us on social media right here. And of course, check out our latest video up there. And right down here, you're gonna find the perfect video for you. Or at least that's what YouTube tells me. Thanks again.